So Vegeta looks for some mic time here as he wants to call out his challenger, Captain America, who just came off of a big win against Mario. Excuse me, in a one-on-one -on -one matchup in a mini zone. And this last bit of buildup makes sense for Vegeta to try to get some last words in, probably get in the head of him, or maybe even just try to take the crowd away from Captain America as he always says he does it for the good old USA. I wonder what, uh, I wonder how, uh, um, Captain America feels about, uh, USA right now. I wonder. Regardless, Vegeta is here. The prince of all sands. I told you, don't be surprised if he looks different. He does. I, I didn't like the whole eyeballs on eyeballs sort of thing. That's, that's just not for me. So I got rid of that. He still looks good, though. Doesn't he? I think he still looks good. I like it. Regardless, let's see what Vegeta has to say. He's on his, ring, on his way to the ring right now without his belt. So I'm assuming this could lead to a scuffle. Some people giving him the thumbs down. Some people clapping. Yeah, understandably so, though. I mean, Vegeta, not the most likable person in terms of his, I guess, character or ego. And really, after winning the international championship, his head has really gone up his own ass, if you will. I've been all over the world. i faced the best competition in some of the biggest venues on the planet. Still, I find myself having to come out here to places like this. It's embarrassing, but it is what it is. Why do you cheer for the losers around here? Is it because you see yourselves in them? Is it because you feel better when you see them? Pathetic pieces of garbage in this ring. It's a shame that the Earth of the Universe has such a low self-esteem, but what's worse is what I intend to do to your cheerleader B-plus player, Captain America. Well, Captain America, this is your chance to show us what a tough guy you are. Come on now. Come on down. Play your music. Don't let the fans down now. Captain America accepts it. Appreciating the adulation too. It's a standing ovation for Captain America. That's what I like to see. And Captain America has overcome the odds in two back-to-back -back matches where he had to deal with Vegeta's interference or Luigi's interference, but in the end, he's still able to do it. And now it's going to be a one-on-one -on -one match between him and a Vegeta at Deadly Series 6. Who is going to win? We're going to see. But right now, Captain America has some words for the champion. Stand him right in the eyes. I respect that. All right, great. Nice presentation. Good talk. Could have used some visual aids, but whatever. Thanks for sharing. Now it's time to get to something important. Oh, hey, perfect timing. I was looking to thump on an inter internet darling, and here you are, heaven sent, exactly the type of guy I was looking for. I've seen a lot of things in my life. A grown man who makes rooster sounds, an egotistical magician who, drink, who drinks his own potion, even a billionaire who thinks his half, he's half vampire, but you, wow. You're really something, aren't you? I don't know what kind of things you do at night, but what I do know is you're damn right. I'm unlike anyone you've ever seen, and that's exactly why I'm going to end your FWF career. You want to do this right now? Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you've been paying attention. This is a historic moment. 
you're witnessing the dumbest superstar in FWF history. Look at him, folks. Isn't he amazing? It's almost, or it'll almost be the same when I humiliate him in front of all of you. You can hype me up for a fight as much as you'd like, but it's not going to work. I'm not going to fight you tonight. I'm not going to fight you tomorrow. I have no interest in fighting you because you're beneath me. You're like a cockroach that I'm going to stomp at Deadly Series 6. Oh, kick to the gut from Captain America. He's going to force Vegeta to fight him. And now Vegeta's firing back on Captain America, going after the legs here. Elbows now from Vegeta. Spinning elbow. He is taking it to Captain America again. He's still getting another altercation, a physical altercation. And once again, it's Vegeta with the advantage. Elbow to the face now. Oh, my God. No Captain America but the counter. Captain America now looking for the coverage power bomb. Vegeta escapes it from behind now. Look at the agility of the prince and now beautiful Hurricane Rana. Oh my god, discus knee strike. And Vegeta has him here. Form shot. Now sending him into the corner. Oh, went for the overhand right. That's countered by Captain America. The discus clothesline drops Vegeta. He rolls to the outside here. Vegeta now saying, come on, bring the fight. Captain America looking to follow him here. And Vegeta catches him with a hurricane run on the outside. Captain America in trouble now. And Vegeta tossing him over to the barricade. Neither the face now stunning him. And another kick. And Vegeta got him by the head now. This is a brawl. We need some help down here to stop these two from beating each other down. Jawbreaker, though, from Captain America. Captain America has him now. Oh, my God. Suplex on the outside. No, the light suplex. Kick to the back from Captain America. He is not done. Oh, my God. Putting the boost to him. Kick to the head. Stomp. This has been a brawl. He's really stomping him now. But Vegeta's in trouble. I thought it was going to be Captain America to control this one because he started the fight. And now he's... Coming back into things. Throws him into the ring. And now Vegeta once again wants more. And once again, Captain America will not give him the satisfaction. Once again, Vegeta's going to go into this match angry and overhyped. And he's probably going to get caught. And I think that's what Captain America is trying to do. So, really, who won here? Who's really winning this rivalry? Doesn't really matter right now. All that matters is who wins at Deadly Series 6. After coming up short in a fatal four-way match, Dr. Doom teams with Money in the Bank qualifier Jack Frost. Frost and Doom to take on Team 7, Naruto Uzumaki and Sasuke Uchiha as they try to overcome their issues that they are having. Not really seeming to be the best team right now as Naruto talked about branching off and trying new things. Sasuke not taking too kindly to that, and he puts on a freaking show in his last matchup. I mean, it's interesting that Naruto says that, because it's been Sasuke who has yet to be pinned in FWF, and it's been Naruto who has been coming up short whenever he gets a big opportunity. I wonder what's going to happen here in this tag team matchup. This, I do not think this is the first time these two are going at it, or these two teams, but huge stakes here for Jack Frost and Dr. Doom. If they win, They'll get a tag team title opportunity following Deadly Series 6 against whoever the tag team champions may be. Oh, Narts are looking for a quick roll up here on Jack Frost as we get started with this tag team match. Jack Frost back to his feet. Naruto now looking for the combination here. And the last time he's two teamed up, Naruto and Sasuke. It was Sasuke trying to control most of the match for himself, so he had to work with Naruto. Now it's Naruto starting this one off a bit more aggressive than normal. Looking for it. And look at Naruto escaping that one. Beautiful escape by Naruto. Back suplex now takes down freaking Jack Frost. Naruto to the top rope now. Oh my god, swat out to the floor. He is soloing right now. Heading back into the ring. Jack Frost is nailed with a dropkick by Naruto. Who isn't done just yet. 
Fox Salt gets it. Pin combination now. One, no. They need to get on the same page here before this freaking big pay-per-view. Jawbreaker. Or maybe Naruto isn't really showing off. Maybe he's just showcasing his ability just for the match. Netbreaker, though. By Jack Frost to shut down Naruto's momentum. And now Frost is doomed looking to take control of this match. Naruto is back up. Got him here. Looking for it. No counter by Naruto. Beautiful counter that time. Irish whipping to the ropes. Hopping over. Hopping over again. Whoa. Takes him down right there. Naruto. Big kick to the chest. To stun Dr. Doom. Not done just yet. Looking for Big knee drop. There we go. Sasuke trying to hype up the fans here. As now, looks like Naruto's going to set him up. Going to help him out here. Nope. Dr. Doom stops it. And now Naruto sends to the opposite corner. Frosted Doom looking to do some teamwork here. What is this? Hung up. Axe handle to the back. The lower back from Jack Frost. Naruto needs to make a tag. But Jack Frost grabbing both arms here. Wrapping him up. And trying to pull one out of its socket. Damn, dude. Spray board. Shooting star. Oh, my God. Insanity. He should be going for a cover, but that was really nice for freaking Jack Frost. I got to say. Shooting star press. But wait a minute. Now it's Jack Frost is caught here in the crucifix. From Naruto. Kicks out early, though. Naruto now. Rushing after him into the corner. Working together with Sasuke here. Here we go. Throwing him down. Oh, double super kick. Oh, wait a Dr. Doom immediately in now. And out Sasuke and Dr. Doom. Oh, my God. What a knee. And a drop kick now. Oh, and my goodness. Sasuke just couldn't get out of the box right there. Immediately destroyed by Dr. Doom. Ground and pound now. Stomp. Dr. Doom has Sasuke where he wants him. Exploder Plex launching him. Sasuke is down. Dr. Doom isn't done yet. Setting him up for the running in Singuri, it looks like. He got it. Naruto looks on, trying to talk into the ears of uh, Dr. Doom. Throw him off his game. Look at Sasuke escape. Sasuke's back up. Knife edge chop now. Oh, look at that combination from Sasuke. Got him stunned. Oh, but Dr. Doom able to avoid it. Counter by Sasuke, though. Through the ropes. Oh, with the spear. Nice. Is that it for Dr. Doom to cover? One. No, just a one count. But that was still nice, no less. Dr. Doom. Devastating forearm shot. Sit into the corner again. More teamwork here from Frost and Doom. Working very well as a team right now. Oh, shoulder tackle. Uppercut. Damn. And again, Jack Frost goes to work on a limb. This time it's Sasuke's limb who's in trouble. Setting them back up. Irish whip into the corner. Got to fight back, Sasuke. Oh, counter. There we go. From the top rope, drop kick, nobody home. Jack Frost might have been going for the avalanche from the top, but it got stopped. Taking him back over to his team's corner. That's a wise move from Jack Frost. Oh, looking for it. No, to the outside he goes. Dr. Doom sent off the apron, and what's going to happen here? Jack Frost heads back in. Sasuke realizes it. Connect with the Chidori. Hug of the leg. One, two, no. Thought he had him there. Now into the corner. Tag team move on the way. That gets stopped. Jack Frost now. He's spilling it. Back to his corner. Now Dr. Doom is not there. Jack Frost waits on him. But instead, look at the strength here. Sasuke gets put upside down. Hung up in the tree of woe. And just getting choked out by Jack Frost. Stop now. Jack Frost taking his time. Going around him. Second rope. Headbutt. Damn. All right. And 
he's got him here. Sasuke's in trouble. Jack Frost now. Looking to set him up. He's probably going to go for the avalanche one more time. He's going to be able to get it. Here we go. No looking for it. Counter into the DT from Sasuke. Sasuke now has the back up to his feet. Back into the corner again. Counter by Jack Frost. Back to his team's corner. Dr. Doom is there this time. Again the opposite corner. Naruto tags himself in though. Oh my god, he just got drilled. And now look at freaking Jack Frost here. He's got both men. Looking for it. Suplex, counter, net breaker that time. Got him with the front face. Oh, he tried it. Got counter with the fireman's carry takedown. Overhand right. Going after him now. It's Jack Frost a bit more vicious than before. Sasuke's back. Sasuke trying to save his partner here. Yoshisaka telling him to leave. Got the snow... Snowmatic, I guess? Sasuke wants to help out Naruto, but Naruto's been taking a beating here from Jack Frost. Counter again. Oh, kicks. Kicks from Naruto. A big kick lands as well. Hesitation dropkick in the corner now. Dr. Doom sit flying off the apron that time. And now... What's Naruto thinking here? He's calling Dr. Doom up. Jack Frost down in the ring. Meanwhile, Naruto resting on Dr. Doom. Heads back into the ring now. He's looking for it here. They might be going for the tag team finish. Uppercut, actually. Top rope now for Naruto. He's not going for the tag team finish. He's going for the finish. Big frog splash. Two. No. Almost did it by himself right there. Almost. Kick to the back lands. Stiff kick to the back. Wait a minute. Counter by Jack Frost. Here we go. Jack Frost now has Naruto up. To the corner again. He really wants his avalanche, folks. And he might be able to get it this time. Actually, no, he doesn't. Tornado. DDT gets him. Looking to finish him off. Oh, probably was going to go for freaking snowball effect. Pal driver, but it's countered. Now in need of the body on Jack, or from Naruto. No, two Naruto from Jack Frost. There we go. Is this teamwork? Nailed it. Nice. And once again, Naruto's in trouble. It's time. Submission applied on Naruto. He's got to escape in here to get back in this thing. It's going to work out for him, though. Naruto sweeps out the legs from underneath. He's able to do so effectively. Waiting for him to get back to his feet. Get some up. Fisherman driver pin combo. One. No. Goes after Jack Frost now. Looking to take him out. Naruto DDT takes out Jack Frost. Now Dr. Doom is stirring. Naruto looking to finish him off. Dr. Doom still trying to get to his feet here. Naruto's waiting on him. Naruto building up speed. Gets the Rasengan again. This time inside the ring, hooking the leg. Oh, but a rope break. Naruto looking extremely impressive here. Dr. Doom counters him again. Oh my god, to the outside. Sasuke wants to get involved, but doesn't look like he's going to be able to here. As Naruto, now it seems like he's the one who doesn't want to play as a team. Damn. Then again, he has tried a couple times. He's been stopped on multiple occasions by Frost at Doom. Torching him on the outside. Damn. Count of six. Dr. Doom will gladly take a count out here. If he can. As he just punishes Naruto. With knees to the freaking shin. Now tosses him back in. Surprisingly. And heads back into the ring. Naruto now. Trying to crawl away to his partner here. Trying to crawl away to Sasuke. But look at the strength of Dr. Doom. Bullplex. Tosses him. And Dr. Doom is looking for it. Oh my god, right in front of Sasuke. A devastating punt. And an insult to injury. Blood pouring from the skull of Naruto. And he's still going after the open wound. Trying to get 
Naruto to his feet, Dr. Doom gets the boot of Doom and that looks like it's going to be it for Naruto. Hook in the leg, Sasuke's got to get in the ring here. Two, and Sasuke saves the match for his team. But look at this. All oh, face first goes Sasuke. Naruto all alone. Whoa, counter that time. What's this going to be? Oh, looking for it, but he gets countered. Dr. Doom. Countered by Naruto that time. Naruto. Just went for the super kick. Oh, shot to the face. Went for the super kick again. Shot to the face again. Went for the super kick one more time. Shot to the face. Drop kick lands. Drops him off the apron. Back to his feet for Dr. Doom. Ross and Shuriken. Can he do it? Hooking the leg now is Naruto. One. Two. No, and again, Dr. Doom kicks out. Uppercut again from Naruto. What a freaking tag team match this has been. I swear to you, I'm not tossing him to the fucking apron, and they won't let me do it. They won't let me throw him to the corner. They just refuse. Dude. Powerbomb. Elbow drop. Once again, trying to make the tag, and once again, stopped. Oh, my goodness. Frosted Doom has been working so well as a team in this one. Naruto is down. Dr. Doom about to end this one. Dr. Doom is about to end this thing. He is looking for the boot of Doom one more time. And he got it. Naruto completely out cold. A bloody mess. There's two. No, he kicks out in spite of the defense being played. Naruto kicks out by himself. Jack Frost trying to get involved. My goodness. Frost and Doom just can't seem to get this thing going. Can't seem to put him away. Turning him around now. Oh, countered by Naruto. Shoulder tackle in the corner. Whoa. Belly to belly suplex lands as well. Shoulder tackle attempted but stopped. And once again, Naruto finds himself alone. Sasuke has yet to get on his feet here. And Naruto's going to need that as soon as possible. Naruto, big shot to Jack Frost. Calling him up to his feet now. Can Naruto do it? Oh, hits him with the axe handle. Back to his feet. Got the axe handle again. Another axe handle. Whoa. Oh, look at that. And a kick sitting him into the corner now. Outside of the ring now. Lifting Jack Frost to his feet. What is Naruto thinking? Naruto got the Rasengan. Rams him into the freaking announce table. Dr. Doom in the corner. Naruto looking for the tag team finisher. The Chidori Rasengan combo. And they get it. Sasuke into the cover. Naruto thinks this is it. And they do it. Wow. Naruto pulling through again for his team. Maybe he doesn't need Sasuke. But in the end, Team 7 wins. And I can tell you right now, being great individuals is not going to help you beat the Plumbers. But it sure looks like looks that way after the performance by Naruto here. Jeez. A stare down again from these two. And they continue. What a performance by Naruto. Are they going to be two-time tag team champions? We will find out.